Hi, um... Picture of where I'm at, and that is, um... I've decided to change the way I was going to present the videos to going forward because they have been helping, but, um... That I'm aware that in certain contexts, in certain ways, they're, they're just there's no point to them. So I've been trying to keep them practical, and for all intensive purposes, I, I didn't want to post in this way until I, I'd managed to think about it more and be sure that this was okay to keep in practical. But right now, I suppose it is practical 100% because um, I still haven't been able to get to that place where I'm able to make that decision. And right now, my life isn't... going my way and I don't know what to do. I feel like uh, quite... Um, restricted in my options and um, sorry about all the light and moving and and I'm at such a loss I'm resorting to a video in an attempt to get myself straight all the same and for that reason I'm just going to keep it focused on where I am what my pressures are, what, what's going on for me. I'm very depressed, unbelievably depressed. And my mental health, um, I don't know, it must really be on an unconscious level because I've recently spoke of not, not liking anxiety whatsoever. And it's just like it's more than coincidence surely if it if it if what i'm experiencing after making that statement um it's just like pure anxiety all the time and it's like my mental health really wants me to experience anxiety and i just yeah i've already said i don't like it and i find myself as a result of life in a place where it's unbearable. Nobody could live here. Unless you've gone through the circumstances that I have. And they are very strange circumstances. So nobody really could live here. And unfortunately the... The answer in my mind that I can see as a result of just living. Is to be depressed. As a practical solution to living because if I'm depressed I can I'm talking about depressed in the sense of uh, actions you know doing the things that you would do when you're depressed it's like you go a bit slower you 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 eat what you want you don't have concern for this that and other it's like that's all beneficial for the body and that's just what I'm looking at, it's my body. It's like... Had a look at my past yesterday. Life, not yesterday, the day before I think. Life forced me to look at it through circumstances. And not only did it force me to look at it, but... Um, It made me realise that um, I, I'm on the cusp at any moment of experiencing the unpleasantness that goes along with that aspect of life again, again, again. 
and um, and right so what what's happened is is that my consciousness has come to my voice all of a sudden so I'll probably just end the video here because I'm not gonna dance around my voice as I said I'm depressed and this is what my mental health has been trying to get me to do all day is um, dance and be anxious but it's just impossible to my mind I don't know how and I don't see why I should so uh, I've gone off and brought up a few things there um, first of all the anxiety I, I can't deal with it at the best of times but um, no I, I, I can't deal with it if, if I'm remotely strong, I just won't accept it. And if I'm utterly beaten, then it's not appropriate. And it's it's just inco incompatible with my life anxiety at present. And the other day I was, I was really put in a position where I was forced to look at how horrific my past is in comparison to my present and um, and knowing that I could slip from this unpleasantness that you've all seen back to that I need to stop, you know, I need to just be depressed. There's just no no other workable solution. Um, my life at present isn't livable. My life at present is a living hell. And I, I guess I've been resting in the fact that I've been doing nothing wrong. But my life has been pushing me back to more and more unpleasant times. Nonetheless, without my action, somehow. Things have just been getting worse and worse, gradually and gradually. Um, and this is me realising the situation a little bit more whilst I'm speaking to you, but um, I'm really gonna try and take the opportunity of this video to um, turn my life around, otherwise I don't know where I'm gonna be finding myself. And the only thing that comes to mind and to really talk through The only thing that could help me, I, at least that's what's come to mind, is talking through one of those um, positive mindset cards that um, that I uh, ran through before. So I'm just trying to find it now. Because um, this one was actually the most... Uh, most important out of all the cards it was the one that I, I used to repeat over and over and over and over in my mind um, but I'm looking at my life and I, I've just been thinking um, recently things are even too bad to, to have that as a mindset card because it just doesn't apply but <clears throat> given what I've just expressed on camera about being able to view my life from my past from my present circumstance I know it's important that I um, dig this card out and talk through it so bear with me I'm just going to put the phone down for one second
How's everybody else this Friday? Getting lots of work done? Um, if I can't find it, I'll just have to try and remember it for you so it's not too much of an issue. It's just uh, for my own mind because I am so weak, having it in front of me will save me a massive amount of energy because. Um, Pardon me. Um, as I understand it, the mind and thinking uses more energy than anything else that we can do. So, spending a few minutes to look for this and is easier than racking my brain to trying to search my memory. This is it, uh, and it's going to be back to front. So I'll show you. See if you can read it and then I'll read it correctly. I see the reality of my life. Everything is pain and I don't hold to the pain. It could always get worse. I'm, I'm shocked. Uh, I'm, a, I'm able to put something out there of use, and um, it, it just literally, I know. Without, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look over it, but I'm almost certain it's, it's just um, put things in perspective for me without a shadow of a doubt. Um. Okay, uh, yeah, uh, I don't have a choice. I literally don't have a choice. I mean, I there's no way any sane person could say they have a choice in this instance because it, to claim they have a choice um would be playing chicken with the devil, really. And everything I've experienced in my life and claiming that I'm living in hell, it's not something I think uh, is a wise thing to um, to do sorry I'm, I'm just in real shock myself of my own situation and circumstance um, so I've I've been struggling with um, sensations I, I mentioned before I'm a previous energy therapist so it's very real to me this was before my mental health and my mental health jumps on everything and makes everything very unpleasant. Stand up with um, energy and sensations, sexual, uh, healing, everything, all of it, mixed it up and made it very, very unpleasant. To the point that I can sit there in front of someone and claim that at present my life is a living hell. And it is. In context to my past, um, it's a living hell. There's, there's no way to beat around the bush. There's no way to, there's no need to try to make it sound any nicer. When 
I'm just trying to state a reality. I could look at my life and I could say with certainty that my life at present is a living hell because of my past. But coming, coming round and actually seeing that um, regardless of my sincerity and intent for life and me trying my absolute to steer my life in positive direction I have been bombarded on a daily basis and it's, it's been relentless that's, that's the thing and because I've not been trying to fight that's been my intent I've just been taking a constant beating for, for a long time And because I have been sincere in trying to find solutions only, it's like I, I can almost state because really that's where life. So I, I've been through a lot of hard times, and that application to life is me trying to be as humble as I can, try and be as sincere as I can to everything I've experienced and applying it to life to get myself out of um, to not create problems for myself again and regardless of that, I've had problems come my way and I've as I said, I've been trying to find solutions all the way through I've tried to just apply what I've learned out of the really hard times. And somehow that, in, in absolute honesty, that isn't enough. Because my life is on the verge of slipping back into most unbelievable um, torment from life um, I, I, I know what I'll need to do I'll need to um, look back over the last six, seven months, which has been a, the relentlessness. I need to assess it, really absorb it. Set that against what I was uh, shown as um, the, the difficult times from the past that just could return at any moment. And then just apply the positive mindset card because it's just like that simple. I, I can't take the risk. I don't understand my mind. I don't understand life. I, I try. I, I don't have a choice but to try because things are, things are so serious. But um, it's just not worth it. If I can, do you know what? The, this is the scary thing. I don't know if I can. On this occasion, I really don't know if I can. The reason being is because, as I said, I've done nothing wrong. I've tried my absolute best to apply 
everything I've learnt in my life up until now. To life to try and make it better. And the relentlessness has just been there all the way. So I'm scared that um, really in essence I've, I've been applying that on some level um, all the way through. And I'm really scared that when I look up when I look up and I see my life over the past six, seven months, I still might not have uh, any space to um, let things go. And um, the, the few things I can see from my life right now do, do uh, kind of point to that. So um, I don't know. I'm going to do my best to try and apply that to my life. Um, And we'll see, I'm sure you'll see another video from me soon if it, if it works, if it doesn't. Um, who knows, I, I might have to, I don't know what, I don't know what, but, but, but um, yeah, I, I, that's why I, I, I want to get on with it. I want to get on with uh, sorting my head out.